Welcome back to Banjo Kazooie. I'm already in the level because this is my second time recording this now because I died a minute ago trying to get the notes. So, yeah, great. If I ever play this game again, it is going to be the Xbox version, because there is no reason to play this one instead. So in my previous attempt at recording this, I learned something. There is a hole down there that the pumpkin can go into. So I don't have to swim around and try not to die this time. Which I feel like is probably a comfort to me and you, because you don't have to watch me flail around in the water anymore. So you know, that's gonna be good. I should probably check in here, see if there are any notes. Yeah, there's notes in here. I didn't really check down here last time. Let's see. Yeah, there's a Jinjo in there. There's really nothing in most of these. Is that another variation on the scream they use for the skeletons and tombstones? <laughs> because it sounds very similar. Are there notes in here? Oh, no, but there's one of these. Oh, my God. 
Oh boy, it's the toilet character. Well, I don't think he has anything useful to offer us right now. <laughs> Something tells me we're not gonna get any help from a toilet. Oh, this is the room that I was in earlier. Well, we haven't checked the hedge maze yet, so let's do that. Let's go here. It's really not a spooky level unless it has a hedge maze, is it? And it's not a hedge maze if it's not incredibly irritating to navigate in every possible way. So they really nailed it. Isn't there a part of the hedge maze with a ramp where you can get up? Yeah, it's over there. How do I get to that? I should probably break that one first and then do that. That seems like it would be the wise decision in this situation. There's nothing super great here, but, you know, they might come in handy. Oh, 
Oh no, why? That is exactly what killed me last time. If it happens again, I think I'm gonna have a problem. have a nice view of everything. But because of Nintendo 64 draw distance, we can't actually find any notes this way, which is uh, not good. Not very helpful at all, really. Hmm. How are you supposed to get onto that ramp as the pumpkin? That's kind of my biggest question right now. Because I know you're supposed to be able to. Hmm. Well... <clears throat> I guess let's go see Mumbo. I do not know what my plan was in that situation, but whatever it was, it didn't go well. Oh yeah, there's notes up there too. I'll have to get those. that great in this particular area, but that's fine. I can get the notes without a good camera. I don't need it. I'm a professional, which is why I died the first time. I still don't know how to get there. Am I able to get up there as a pumpkin? It does not look like I'm able to. spins around like that. 
It's kind of annoying. Hey, maybe, uh, maybe I could go up here. And I'll get up on the wall that way. Seems like a good plan to me. And there we go. Okay, so where is Mr. Lago the toilet? Because if I had to guess, there are probably notes where he is. Hey, we found him. Oh, are there really no notes in here? Just gold feathers. Okay, well I don't think there's anything left to do as a pumpkin then. I guess we'll just go turn back into Banjo and Kazooie. Hey, I guess you could call those, uh, living tombstones, you know? I am concerned by the lack of notes that I have right now. Just, it, it seems like um, a very small amount to have. Especially when you compare it to a number like 100. Well, maybe there's some in here. I remember now, I kept trying to get the notes that were up on these things, and I kept dying because of these ghosts.
would honestly be willing to bet that the rest of them are just in here. Because it's starting to seem like it a little bit. Are there no notes up here? What the heck? Okay, 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 where the heck are the rest of them gonna be then? Because I am genuinely confused as to where they're gonna be now. Good, very excellent. these notes. How many am I missing? I'm missing 17. Where am I going to find the other 17 notes? by this point. There were no notes in that room, not a single one. Okay, 
Oh, I didn't go in that window yet. Yeah, that's a good sound to hear when you first walk in a room. I'm not dealing with these ghosts anymore. few notes in here. That's better than no notes at all. Let's see what's in here. This actually seems like it could potentially be the rest. Well, hey, you just passed your best note score for this world. Okay, I'm only missing four of them now. I was really hoping that that would be it, but no, there's more. I bet it's in there. My bet is that I have to get into that thing somehow with the pumpkin. If anybody wants to explain how I'm supposed to pull that off, now would be a good time to tell me. Now would be a very good time to tell me how I'm supposed to do this. Like, what is this? What are these expectations? You want me to get a pumpkin up to the roof of this thing? Unless there are, like, secret paths from floor to floor, I don't think that's gonna happen. Am I really gonna have to look up a guide again? Because it's starting to seem like I am. So apparently that's not even a real way to go. So my suspicions were entirely incorrect. But we do need the pumpkin, I think. I'm pretty sure we need it. It is entirely believable that the four notes I'm missing are going to be where I think they are. Not in here, what the heck? Where are they? 
Where are these notes? no way that they're over here. I've been over here already. I got all the notes that were in the well, so they can't be there. It's not the ones up there. I got those already. Ow! I couldn't even see the enemy that just hit me. Okay. I looked in there already. these already. Aha! Here they are. You found all 100 notes on this world. Well done. And now, we never have to come back here again. We do have to go be a pumpkin again for something, though. The, the jiggy outside the world. Dang, this guy falls asleep quick. Glad we got all the notes in this world. Now we don't have to deal with it anymore. It's kind of starting to bug me a little bit. Wow, your best note score for this world is now 100. The heck, he's just faster than me. That's stupid. Mumbo, he is in here also. He is also in here for some reason. So then we break this, and inside there is a switch for the water level. Uh, 
you know what's next. You know what that means. How did he fall asleep again that quickly? Oh yeah, that's right, we need to take the pumpkin to the the room with the Gobi's Valley painting. I think that's the room. Because you can get a cheat. You can get a Cheeto cheat for going there. It's a very slow thing. It's not it's not good at moving distance quickly. I wish I could see where I'm going. All right. D oh, we just gotta navigate this. I can't see. The camera is getting stuck on things. Where, where, where really liked you, like. They really enjoyed making you navigate thin platforms, didn't they? Hey, there he is. Cheeto Baron Bird have found once more another spell they get. If one more page I see you turn, then Grunty shall Cheeto burn. Nasty witches, so tell Cheat I shall. Red feathers on St. Castle floor in the treasure trove cove. So yeah, let's go put the cheat in on the thing. You know, after we walk back across this garbage. Mumbo magic get weak. Mumbo magic run out. Okay, uh, yeah, we gotta go this way. Haven't been here in a while. Have to resist the urge to pick up all the notes and stuff. Why'd they have to make all the collectibles so fun to get in this game? It's like Donkey Kong 64. You know, I have full crystal coconuts, I don't need these things, but I'm still picking them up because they make a funny sound when I grab them. Okay, let's do it. Oh yeah, we gotta kill this guy first, though. 
Okay. Okay, where is the F? There it is. F. E. A. EA Games. T. H. E. R. P. S. Bear and bird get 100 red feathers. 100 maximum now is... Okay, I think now we gotta go up here, because this is where the next world should be, if I am remembering correct. Okay, let's see here. What do we have to do exactly to open this up? Well, that's a good shortcut. I like that one. That's it. You've created a shortcut. Hop in and see. No. Okay, we hit this and it'll go up again. I don't feel like dealing with bees right now, so I'm not going to do that. Hey, there it is. Oh boy. We now have access to the most terrifying world in this entire game. The amount of times I died in there on Xbox is uncountable. I am definitely going to be using save states for the engine room. You can count on that. Well, nothing there. So, I don't think I'm gonna go in, in this episode, I think I'll do that next time. But I wanna see what is in the other room real quick. 
Where is the next room? <laughs> the other room. Oh, it's over there. Okay, so we can go over here now, which is kind of cool. But what is in this gold feather? And what is in this? Nothing. Alright. Well, let's go over here then. Oh, it's a note door. I'm going to hazard a guess and say that this is where we go to get to Click Clock Wood. Wow, this hallway is terrible. Dude, oh my god. Yeah, this is the Click Clock Wood room. Oh god, he's coming. God, these leaves are so awkward. Don't have enough notes for that. Gotta finish Rusty Bucket Bay first. And what's over here? Oh yeah, that's how you make the thing appear, because you need to make it first. Kind of stupid, but okay. Oh, you know, we gotta see what the water level 3 switch is good for. We gotta see where it'll let us go. Next time. <laughs>